Okay, it's 9 May 2020, and I don't have much time to catch Comet 2019Y4. Kind of bummed out, damn tree lines. Okay, there's Venus. Time is 9.28. It is May 12, 2020, and the days are long, sunrise about 5.30 in the morning and sunsetting at by, by 8.30 but still there's still light in the horizon. Here I am trying to get something. Yes, I'm in my front driveway. Okay. I got excellent and I'm in my driveway so let's just finish this uh, polar alignment with sharp cap and park the mount I haven't been out here in a long time, so I remember with my astrograph, Newtonian 10 inch. So, um, how do you get polar line? How do you do that? How do you help? Want to show me how you do that? to thank you for your time. You're welcome. It's been fun participating. Okay. Hey Skywalker, here is C2017 T2 Pan Star. Um I'm not using any guide scope. I'm not using some piece of I'm just using shark cap. And looking at it, I don't. Oh, I see it. It's right there. Sucks, man. I'm imaging um, C2019 Y4 Atlas, and it's uh, 12 May 2020, and I'm doing minute exposures for two hours, and um, I'm going through that street light over there. She's still alive. Atlas Y4 is still alive. Okay. Still a clear night. And I'm imaging C2017 T2 Pan Star. I'm using the all Orion products here. The mount, Richie Crichton 6, and the uh, Orion CT80, and I'm using, I'm also using the Stag, Stag.
Starshoot Auto Guider. Everything's all awry in here. And I'm about to hit that tree line over there. 